And with many day jobs on hold, some Americans are using their skills to do good. One clothing designer modified her product to help healthcare workers get through long shifts. Amanda Brandeis shows us the simple innovation now popping up in hospitals around the country. While they hope for a healthier tomorrow, healthcare workers aren't letting their guard down. No, not at all. <laughs> As states loosen stay at home restrictions, nurse Brianna Salas and her team at the University of California, San Diego stand ready to respond on an unpredictable front line. I think it was a calling for me. Um, I really love my job. But in the face of COVID-19, their jobs have grown more complicated. It's a whole process. We wear a gown, we wear a mask. Bufants and glasses, um, it can take a toll after 12 hours. There's, you know, pictures going around with the, you know, mask bruising, but also where the elastic goes around the ears, it breaks down the skin on their ears. It's a new problem for many healthcare workers now forced to wear protective equipment for long hours. I thought, uh, this is what I can do. When the pandemic hit, Celeste Dugray's sewing sanctuary went silent. I love to sew. I just love being behind the machines. Then the activewear designer learned about a simple innovation giving nurses relief. I'm using the fabrics I normally use. And got right back to work, sewing buttons onto headbands. Called Ear Saver headbands, the mask attaches to the buttons. Celeste asked friends online if they wanted one. And her niece loved it and told people about it. And then she ordered 50. The request poured in. I'm like, oh. I need more buttons. With the help of her reliable workhorse, she's churning out dozens a day. 600. 600 of these. I reached out to her and she actually, um, she came in and dropped them off the next day. And now Celeste is saving ears across the country. Oklahoma, Illinois, Massachusetts, Utah, Georgia. Seeing what they're going through gives me a new appreciation. It's so simple, but super helpful alleviated one problem. I mean, that's one thing, less thing that they have to worry about. You know, they're just doing their job. So that we can all have a healthier tomorrow. In San Diego, I'm Amanda Brandeis reporting.